feel like I feel like people people shouldn't see me just like rip around the city you with a shotgun. Could have bought a case, but you didn't. Well, I didn't. Eh, cases are overrated. Anyways, we got the old double barrel shotgun. We definitely need to pull both triggers. We, we're gonna do that tomorrow. And we've got some vintage shells and a couple calls. And that's pretty much all this place has. This place was awesome. This is Easy Money Pawn Shop in Omaha. So if you guys are in Omaha, come check it out. Clay soaked it up. Didn't have everything. Didn't have a decoy. Well, they had a decoy. He said it was vintage. Didn't want to sell it, so I respect it. But we pretty much have everything else. Yeah. We're ready to go hunting, boys. Oh, should we do a roulette? Who has to use this? I feel like we should do that. We'll do it tomorrow. Okay. See you guys in the morning. All right, folks, made it to the next spot. We ditched the boat. We threw it in the trees. We put all the decoys out on this point, and we're just sitting on this timber line here. <laughs> Sammy's up with the old pawn shop gun. Right here, Sam. Oh! <laughs> all right, Bonzo, this is your moment. You're the only one that hasn't killed with this I'm the only one that hasn't killed. I just realized I'm cheeks. Since the person with the double bear has a disadvantage, we're letting them shoot first. The second I hear one shot, then I'm shooting. But if it's a single, then no, I'm not shooting. You know, it's like shoot your lane. If there's a big flock, pick your lane. Uh, but we're giving the guy with the double barrel an advantage. I especially need it next time I'm up. Right now, Bonzo's up, and the birds are dumped in. We're literally just sitting here in the grass, and they're loving it. This one right there. In the tree, right here. Oh, <laughs> good shot, Bonzo. Dude, you guys are really good with the double bear. I feel like I just suck. Dude, that was an incredible shot. Right now, we're having a lot of birds. They're circling us, and not a ton of them are finishing. So I called that shot because it was in range. For, obviously, Bonzo shot it. What did we got? Weegin? Another Weegin. All right, I am up. I'm the only one that hasn't killed with this gun. Oh, God. Oh. Hey. <laughs> what up, boys? <laughs> what did I just say? Oh, who's the turn? Is it sl slamming? I was just saying, I was the only one that didn't kill nothing. I think this is so fun. Dude, this gun is dope. I, I actually like it. Now that I killed one, there you go, Sam. You're up. Like, I'm going to go grab that bird. Phew. Gaddy down, boys. <sighs> Finally. All right. Sam's up. Oh. It's crazy. This morning, starting not to feel super good about this area, the farm. All it took was a little adjusting right here, Sam. Kill him. I got the one. Sam never you, shot. You know, it was like right there. I didn't want to. Do you want to sit in the middle, Sam? Why don't you sit in the middle? Yeah. Oh. Didn't you didn't shoot at all? No. No, it was like oh. right here I next to John's house. Like, okay. All right. I'll go get my bird. Sam, you sit in the middle. Just let me take it. <laughs> hey, I got him, buddy. Add a kid. It's a Bonzo's turn. Bonzo's up. Right here. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> Swing and a miss. Oh, you wasted both shells, so I'm up. Dang. That was tough. He was maple leafing. All right. He was going. All right, boys, I'm up. We've only got, including this one, five more shells. Once we're done with that, we're gonna have to go normal mode, but so far, pawn shop gun's doing good, and the call. <laughs> oh, the second shot! Dude, using two triggers is super trippy. Nice, that's a Weegin. Well, a nice little widge came in and uh, kind of plopped her in the head there. Here I'm up. Daddy. We got him, boys. Got the old gaddy. I'm out of shape. That thing ran me all the way across the marsh. Who's up with the gun? I'm up. You're up. Yep. Slam and clapped one, huh? All right, Bonzo's up. How many shells we got left? I think the last two. The last box. two? Yeah. Uh-oh. This might be the end of the... Uh... Remember, save this box. It's worth 25 bucks. Yeah, I guess. Oh, I shouldn't have crushed it. It might be. Almost shot an entire box. And then it's fun time. And just get your limit. <laughs> nope. Nope. Nada. Is that the end of them? That's the end of them. The last two of those shells. Rip. Shells are... I can't believe these work. 50-year-old paper shells. 
We oh, killed how many birds we kill? I killed one with it. Think, no, two? I think one. I killed two with it. I killed two, you killed two, Slayman, you killed three. So we killed two, four, six, seven. Now it's time just to use the normal gun. There are birds everywhere, but a lot of them are going in there, which is where we wanted to hunt, but we, it was too deep. So I'm gonna start walking in there. The boys, Sam and Bonzo, are gonna stay on the island. Basically, me and John are gonna go in the trees here. We're gonna walk out here and just stand next to a big, tall tree, and uh, I'll try to polish off my limit while the boys stay here and hold down the fort. You guys stay tuned. Here. <laughs> Another daddy. One more to go, baby, we're up to five. There's a limit there, boys. Hee hee hee. Shoo! Got the old gaddy done. That's the limit there, boys. Did I hit the sign? Shoo! Well, folks, we made it out. Uh, John, did you get the tire pop on camera? Well, I popped a tire. Ripped to the old duck boat. Yeah, that's not what you want. Apparently there's a culvert in the thingy, and I hit it, and we need to change the tire. This, this is our second flat tire with this thing. It's our second flat tire, and I never get flat tires. I've literally had a flat tire, like, never had it on any of my cars. I've had, like, maybe one or two on a trailer, and I've, we've already had two flat tires with this boat. <sighs> I gotta get a new tire. But anyways, it was a good day out on the marsh. It took some, took, took some tweaking, all right? It wasn't fire out the gate. Bonzo clapped the first bird with a double barrel when we were hunting out of the boat, and then after that, it was kind of tough, and we were like, dude, Something ain't right, you know, you when you know something ain't right, it just wasn't right. So we made the move. I actually found a really cool spot in the timber, and uh, we actually ended up just throwing the boat in the trees and stood up on the ground, and we shot a bunch, 